three young boys, all grieving the loss of their grandfather. Now creating yellow hearts as a way to remember him. Jeff Wilson died in May after contracting COVID-19. His daughter Donna has created a wishing tree where the boys can place the hearts along with any messages for the man they called Pappy. It's helped them in ways that I can't even explain. Um, the wishing tree that we've produced has been our way that they can write something to Pappy, they can express any way that they're feeling. And it's, it's a way for them to express their grief. Being so young, it's really difficult. They were so close to him. And in years to come, they will always associate yellow hearts and yellow in general with Pappy. And yellow hearts is just so special to all of us. The hearts are now being spotted up and down the country, a symbol of remembrance, uniting families who've lost loved ones to coronavirus. Sheila Gompertz died with COVID-19 in April. Her husband David came up with the idea for the Yellow Hearts and says it's really helped. I feel that we've done something useful. Uh, you know, that's what our family's about. Uh, we've always tried to be involved with other people and the public and things like that. And, uh, this is a, a sort of tangible thing that we've done together. Like so many families affected by COVID, Donna wasn't able to see her father in person before he died. We haven't been able to grieve in the normal way. We haven't been able to have a funeral. We haven't been able to, to, to dress our loved ones. Seeing a yellow heart is so positive and it just gives you a warm feeling and know that dad is up there looking down on us. A simple heart, but with so much meaning. Helping families remember those they've loved and lost. Leila Hayes, 5 News.